Hello and in this screencast for Apache ISIS we're going to look at yet another of the ISIS add-ons. This time I've extended my uh, domain object to include a location uh, property and the idea is to uh, show the objects on a map. Um, and so to look at the code briefly, uh, here is the uh, property I've added and I've also created an outline method which at the moment you can see does nothing. Um, so the idea is that I can go to one of my domain objects and I can go to the pick up location and I can specify a value but as I say the action is not yet implemented so nothing really happens at that point point. Um, and also in the uh, fixture scripts I've set up so the first three objects that get created will all have that same action uh, called just to save some time so let's uh, stop the app and let's go to the ISIS add-ons website and we're going to be using the GMAP3 uh, plugin and if we go to that uh, GitHub repo, lots of screenshots and so forth and again we have all the details here and the first thing that we need to do, if I can find it, is that we need to get hold of the dependency and this dependency is going to go into the DOM module um, because there's an interface that we need to implement and that interface will be implemented by simple object so it's going to be implementing an interface called locatable and uh, the method to implement is called getLocation now if I just move this code up to where I have my pickup location um, then I'm going to use the pickup location as the location as defined by the interface so get pickup location and I'm going to mark this as programmatic so it doesn't appear in the user interface, it gets ignored the other thing I can do that the service provides is it gives me um, the, the module provides it gives me a service called the location lookup service. So I'll have one of those that will get injected, and that's going to be used for the implementation of this method. So I can go location lookup service dot lookup an address, and then that can be used to set up the pickup location like that. The only other thing I need to do is I need to make sure that my app manifest is updated in order that that location lookup service is indeed uh, picked up and it's, that's the GMAP3 service module. Okay, so I think those are the three things I need to do. And so with the application now running, let's take a look. So we can see that we've now got three um, locations, which is, is looking good. On the table, we've now got a new option here to show these objects on a map and there they are for the three locations we specified um, and we can follow th click through and we can get down to the object and I can also use the pickup location to change this to I don't know um, uh, how about Covent Garden okay and uh, on the main page yep moved over to Covent Garden Okay, so that's uh, how you go about using the uh, GMAP3 module. The main thing was to implement the appropriate interface and um, add in the class path. Give it a go.